All right, I am back after a very long break. It is now time to load back up, and we are going to go deeper into the temple. Uh, let's see, we are in the temple in the woods. Sky, the Skyview Temple, maybe? Is that what I just saw? Who knows? That's what we're doing. Um, all right, here we are. So we just got that beetle thing, and I am using motion controls now. Oh, oh. Okay, I fly it with fly it with the controllers. I don't know if I like that. I like the motion controls for like when I'm fighting, but everything else, like the flying and everything is it's not as fun. Okay. Let's take a look at the map here. What am I doing? Alright, so I need to get through this. To get to her, it's the bird statue. So I probably need to get it into this chest so that I can open up this door. That sounds sounds about right. But let's go fight everyone first. All right. Hacha. Where are you, bat? What is this? Okay. Oh, there's a heart thing. Okay, and there's a... Uh... I'm gonna cut that down. Make it, make it. Oh, okay, cool. Let's go get this heart. Two more to go. All right, but I want to shoot that in the box. Nope, nope. Rupees. What else can I cut? I just have to fly that beetle up in the air. Oh, okay. I'm gonna cut you down. Oh, 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 oh. Nice. I hear fighting music. Okay, there's a beetle up there. Or, I mean, a spider. Okay, here's the chest. Ah, that shadow. Oh. Oh. Nope. All right, that wasn't too hard. Okay. How do I get that third one open? Right, because we had that two... Two eyes before. 
What's going on here? Oh. Okay. You need. You probably need one of these boxes to stand on. Oh, stop, stop. Oh my gosh, I hate these controls. What the heck? A little inversion would be nice. Okay, maybe I can get this box. There it is. Okay. Tired. Okay. Is it the middle? Almost. There it is. Nice. Okay. Let's see what's in the chest. Yeah, okay, of course. That's what I needed. Is there a way to get over there? Maybe I, I get it with the uh, this. Oh my gosh! I'm so bad at piloting this thing. All right, let's try it again. Go. Yeah, let's go this way. Avoid the trees. Turn. Okay, that's how you get up there. But is there a point to, to being up here? Maybe the point was just to kill that spider, but that's... That's fine, whatever. Alright, give me that money tree. Oh, I would have had to have done that anyway, because... There's no way of getting back up here. Right, because, yeah. Okay. Thought for a second that was a waste of time. Kind of is, but I get it. Okay, let's go find that door that needs a key. But I wonder what's in these now. Let's find out. So far, nothing. Well, that was fun. All right. That was that one, that one. I mean, are these worth checking out? I mean, I got time. Do you got time? I got time. I mean, if you didn't have time, you could just turn off the video. All right, I'm not going to try. Whatever. All right. 
Okay, we gotta go. Oh. Okay. Okay. I see what's up. You gotta just cut him down. Turn, 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 turn. All right. No, come on, come on. All right, well. Nope. Okay. Boom. Did it. What's down here? Oh, bigger ones. Ah, that's fine. We'll just do this. Balance. Balance. Yeah. 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 No. Open it. Let's see what crazy monsters in here. What is this? Oh, where's my shield? Okay. What? Was that it? I thought that was gonna be like a like a Hydra or something, you know? Unless I got really lucky and I just cut off all three heads at once. That was really anticlimactic. Really? That was it? Whatever. Eat it, buddy. Oh, he just fell to his death. All right. Come on. Let's fight. I'll fight. Oh, I know what to do here. Okay, I need to remember that hearts are in those flowers. There's that. This. This must be that room where I got this beetle. Yep. Okay. That's fine. Oh. Alright, come here, dude. I'm gonna jostle you. Oh, come here. Come on. Oh, there's a guy behind me. Ooh, that was scary. All right, take care of them both. You just gotta jostle them. Jostle them. Oh, let's save. Okay, I need like an H key. What's going on in here? Rupees, nice. I can climb up this. Oh, no, no, get down. You always gotta check to make sure there's no, like, spider. Okay, that looks pretty safe. All right, time to jump. Oh, okay, well. Time to 
Time to jump. Okay. Jeez. <laughs> Fell to my death. Can I reach that from here? I don't want to fall again. I mean, I guess I could. Jeez. Okay. Jumping! Oh, come on! <laughs> If you're going to fall to your death, I might, you might as well just swing your sword. Okay. Okay, what if I climb down a little bit? Can I climb down? Okay, there it is. I'm supposed to climb down a little bit just to get more distance on my jump here. Okay. So hanging, right, when I'm going on the tightrope, hanging there, it uses my endurance, but I can probably indefinitely hang on to this rope and not be punished for it. Oh, that chest right there, that looks like a special chest. That's probably, oh, I gotta climb up. I'm hitting the, the wall. All right, climb up. That's probably what I want in that chest. Or probably what I want is in that chest. You've probably watched enough footage by now to know I don't English very well. Yep, H key. There we go. Check the thing. Okay. Okay, back across. Nope, nope. Come on. Balance. Well, I guess it doesn't matter if I balance, because if I fall to my death, we've already established that I don't lose health. Oh, you want me to... Okay. Sick. Look who it is. I thought that tornado I stirred up would have tossed and torn you apart. Yet here you are, not in pieces. Not that your life or death has any consequence. It's just that the girl that matters it's just the girl that matters now. And I can sense her here, beyond this door. Yes. We plucked Her Majesty from her perch in the clouds, and now she's ours. Oh, but listen to me. I'm being positively uncivil. Allow me to introduce myself. I am the Demon Lord who presides over this land you look, up, you look down upon. This world you call the surface. You may call me... Uh... Girahim. 
In truth, I very much prefer to be indulged with my full title, Lord Gurahim. But I'm not fussy. Did you really just draw your sword? Foolish boy. By all rights, the girl should have fallen into our hands already. She was nearly ours when that loathsome servant of the goddess snatched her away. Do you have any idea how that made me feel inside? Furious. Fascinating. Outrage, sick with anger. This turn of events has left me with a strong appetite for bloodshed. Still, it hardly seems fair, being of my position, to take all of my anger out on you. Which is why I promise up front not to murder you. No. I'll just beat you, or beat you within an inch of your life. <laughs> He's kind of got a weird Power Ranger suit going on. Like the, the old Mighty Morphin ones. Alright, buddy. Eat this. Oh, yeah. Doesn't seem too hard. Where's he at? Oh. What do you? What the heck? So okay, okay, so he blocks with his hand, which is weird. But where you at, boy? You weird Power Ranger! What the heck? Okay, okay. So he kind of tracks the sword. You see that? But when he's, when he's done tracking the sword, I can just swipe away. It's gross, dude. Oh. Pulling out a sword, eh? Alright, check this out. Ooh. Look at that, knock those back at him. Oh, 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 ouch. Okay. Okay, I should have used my shield on that one. Ouch. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, cool. Okay. Okay, okay. We got this, we got this. Just like the other enemies, you gotta... You gotta not hit them where the sword is blocked. So if it's vertical, you would hit them on the other side. Yeah, like that. See, he was on the right, so I hit him from the left. <laughs> that guy was super easy. What? Well, you've put up more of a fight than I have thought possible out of such a soft boy. But don't clap for yourself just yet, or quite yet. That sword, that sword of yours is the only reason you're still alive. I fear I spent far too long teasing and toying with you. The girl's presence has all but faded from this place, which means there's no reason to linger here. Goodbye, Sky Child. Run, and play this time. Get in my way again, though, and you're dead. <laughs> Alright, that guy was pretty easy.
<gasps> heart piece. No, that's a full heart. Nice. Give it to me. Cool. I bet you there were hearts in this. In these. Yep. Ah, that guy was super easy, though. I didn't need those hearts. I mean, I did get hit, like, what, twice? Hmm. This kind of looks like the temple... There's a temple in uh, Breath of the Wild that looks a lot like this. Yeah! There's a temple in the Breath of the Wild that's like... It doesn't have the water? Like, it, it's really old. But it looks just like this. Which is... So, Skyward Sword is actually the first in the timeline. And Breath of the Wild, at the moment, is the last game in the timeline. So, it would make sense that when you visit this place in Breath of the Wild, it has aged a lot. Skyview Spring. Master, I have a message written in the language of the gods of old. Allow me to trans translate for you. From the edge of time, I guide you, the chosen one to carry out the goddess's mission. The spirit maiden who descended from the clouds must travel to two sacred places to purify her body. You stand in one of these places, Skyview Spring. The other is known as the Earth Spring. This second spring is hidden away deep within this scorched earth of Elden. The spirit maiden must, ever mindful of the heavy task entrusted to her, has set out for the second sacred place. Oh, it's another tablet piece to go put up in Skyloft. You got the ruby tablet. The withered surface of the stone tablet feels very old. Master, as I just translated, it would appear that Zelda purified herself in the waters of the spring. I calculate a 97% chance that she has already set up for Elden, where another great spring exists. However, it is not clear what method of travel Zelda used to move from here to her next destination. My analysis suggests you should take the tablet to the altar in Skyloft. Doing so will likely open a new column of light on the surface, allowing you to descend to another area and continue your search for Zelda. Let's return to the sky once more before continuing our search. The bird statue outside can take us back up. <clears throat> oh, this guy. Marketing. Hey, it's me, Kui. Did you find the girl? Oh, that's too bad. But it sounds like you at least know where you need to search next to find her queen. That's something, right? I'm so glad I've finally been reunited with all my Kikwi friends. It's all thanks to you, Kuweep. 
with any luck. Hopefully, you'll find that girl you've been searching for real soon. Karu, or Koruko. Take care, okay? Aww. You know, before we leave, there were some goddess cubes out by that tree. Can I... Okay, let's return to the sky. Okay, ouch, man. Master Lunk, I forgot my name was Lunk. When you hit the goddess cube with the skyward strike earlier, I was able to detect a resulting energy reaction above the clouds. Oh, now you're telling me. The location I have marked on your map indicates the spot where I sense an energy reaction. Oh. Okay. I advise you investigate the area around this location. Okay. So, goddess cubes correspond with these things in the sky. Makes sense. Kind of. But, before I do that, there's some more goddess cubes I want to go to. There were those goddess cubes by that big tree. Other goddess cubes. Man, there's a lot of goddess cubes in here. I mean, I, I wasn't quite sure what they were earlier, so... Makes sense they'd still be around. Or maybe I just wasn't looking for them? I, I don't know. Oh, okay. Let's see if I can catch some more bugs here. Alright, this time, I'm going to knock them off the tree. And then I'm going to net, net, net. Got one. You caught one woodland rhino beetle. Collectors can, collectors often polish the hard cara, cara paces of the beetles to make them tougher. It's the strongest of all the insects. Cool. Give me that. Got another one. Okay, got his cube up there. Can I climb up this? Nope. What about over this side? Nope. Okay. Yeah, it must be something I have to come back to because I can't... Well, what's up with that? Nothing. Looks like a button. Nothing. So obviously, I have to hit that with something, and that'll come down that I can climb up there. Okay. Okay, well, I can't get any of those goddess cubes then because they're all up there. That must be a later part of the game. So, I guess we'll just go back to Skyloft. After I take some money from these trees. There should be a bird statue down here somewhere. Okay, let's get back to Skyloft. To the sky! Alright, where was that thing she wanted me to check out? It's over here, so it's behind me. There it is. Oop, there's a little speed thing. All right, let's do this.
All right, normally he parachutes by himself, but that time I <laughs> just fell on my face. That's cool. Oh, it's a chest. Oh, nice. You made your adventure pouch bigger. You can now fit an additional item inside. Cool. Didn't I get two goddess cubes? That means there should be another chest available up here in the sky somewhere. Like this one. Yep. Okay. Well, since I'm here, I'll check this place out. What is this? Oh! There's another heart container. Like, they really want me to see that. <laughs> the lumpy pumpkin. Well, well, welcome. I can see you from I can see from your handsome outfit that you're a Skyloft knight. I hope you'll make yourself at home. Have the rupees sitting on the top of the chandelier caught your eye? Don't go thinking you can get those down, you hear? You might think that you could knock the rupees down by bumping something or making the chandelier shake, but don't even think about it. Are we clear? So the, the game like shows me like emphatically that they're up there and then the game tells you not to try it. Okay. Welcome to every bird rider's favorite rest stop, the Lumpy Pumpkin. This is the one and only place you can enjoy some of our famous pumpkin soup. What do you think? Wanna try a bit and see what all the buzz is about? Nah, I'll pass. I get it, sure. This place is good for more than just drinking soup. You can also meet some colorful folks here. Make yourself at home. Don't break anything or make a mess of my pub. Especially my special ordered custom made chandelier hanging from the ceiling. Jeez. Oh, I don't want to see you shaking it. Don't even look at it sideways. Am I clear? There's a lot of attention paid to the chandelier. Oh, I can just fly the... Oh, it won't give me the option to fly the, uh, the beetle in here. What is this? No rough housing on the balcony. Big ruckuses cause the chandelier to shake. Should I do it? Now accepting applications for workers to plow the, the pumpkin field. Okay. Well, if I could use my beetle, I could just collect all that stuff up there. It's a heart piece, though. How far? How close am I to? I need two more hearts, and I could get oh another heart piece. Or I need two more heart pieces, so I can get another heart. Hmm. Okay. Well, we know that's there. If I find another heart, I'll come back and. Mess with that chandelier. Okay, where am I going next? Where's that other... Here, it's to the left. There it is, there it is. The flying in this game is so ridiculous. Again, I wish I could invert... My flying... Oh, what the... Uh, oh, uh, what's the attack button? Okay, that is, that's what, alright, let's try that again. Come here, you crazy rock thing flying in the sky. Boom! Oh, let's get this, get this other one. Alright, alright. Oh, dude, they have good aim. Oh jeez, I have bad aim. All right, get out of here, get out of here. Abort mission. Whoops. Oh, 
Okay. That must be the... Yep, there it is. There it is. That's funny. Oh. Well, it looks like I'm going to go break a chandelier. Okay, it's connected to another goddess cube. So, was that chest here before they built the pumpkin? Has the pumpkin always been here? Like, these goddess cubes are from the beginning of time, right? So, did that just appear here? How does that work? I don't, I don't know. Like, maybe it was there and then the pumpkin grew and it picked up the chest. But then that means we're standing, but this is like a, uh, like, the, like, there's beams and wooden things and walls. This is a constructed building that looks like a pumpkin. It's not actually a pumpkin. Okay, okay. Kacha! Whoops. Well, here we go again. Haha! <laughs> Why would you do that? Come down here this instant. Oh, jeez. You got a heart piece. This completes the heart container. Your heart capacity will increase by one. Well, I'm just gonna... Take this money. And I'm just gonna leave. Oh, hey now. You don't think you can come in here and break my chandelier and just get away with it, do you? Hey now. Okay, okay, okay. 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 What is wrong with you? Just look at what you've done. You broke my fancy custom order chandelier. You're going to be working for me for free until you pay off every single rupee that chandelier cost me. Got that? Are you ready to own up to your responsibilities? No way. What did you just say? You got some nerve coming in here, busting up my chandelier and thinking you can get away with it. Oh, can I leave? Buddy, I'm here to... I'm trying to save Zelda. Okay, okay. Now I'm just trapped here for all eternity. Okay, okay. That's right. I'm going to hold you to that. Let's not waste any time putting you to work. I need you to deliver my famous soup to Iga Skyloft's Night Commander. The Night Commander is a regular here. He says he can't get his day started without a bowl of my soup. What do you say? Are you ready to deliver some soup to the Night Commander? I was going to go to Skyloft anyway. Hey, you haven't gotten an empty bottle. You need an empty bottle if you want to carry soup. Go get yourself one and come back here. Okay. If I knew where I could get empty bottles, I would have a lot more fairies on me. Well, let's just go Skyloft. Let's do this. I'm never coming back, dude. Broke your chandelier. Now I'm going away. Skyloft is over here. Huh. Wonder if that speed thing works in both directions. Like if I fly up from this side, will it shoot me out? Nope. Okay, I was I just got impatient. Here we go. Try that again. There we go. Did it save me time? Not really. And, oops. Here we go. 
actually, I don't hit the button and he automatically uses the sail cloth. But there are those times I don't and he just lands on the ground. That's pretty funny. Master, I have confirmed the location of a second opening in the cloud barrier. It is located in the skies to the northeast. This opening will allow you to access a new area on the surface. I suggest you fly there as soon as you complete necessary preparations. Necessary preparations? Like, what do I need? I don't think I really know until I get there. All right. Well, guys, we are coming up on an hour. I think I'm going to. Okay. Kukio, Kukio. Where could that child have gone? Oh, Kukio. Where did you go? What will I do if she's been kidnapped? Oh, Lunk. What perfect timing. You haven't seen my Kukil, have you? I don't know who that is. I, I see. Well, I've been out trying to find Zelda. Please, Lunk, won't you help me look for her? I have been looking everywhere, but I can't find her. I've asked everyone I could I could find for her for help. And a few people have said she's been spotted with some unknown person with a scary face. Someone else even said they thought they'd seen her carried off by a monster. A monster! She must have been kidnapped. She's so cute and friendly. Someone must have just walked off with her. Fine, Kukio, please. Please. It breaks my heart to think she's somewhere out crying. Please, Lunk. Yeah, dude. Let's go find this kid. Thank you. The Night Academy should be proud to have a student like you. Please, find my daughter, quickly. Alright guys, that is it for this session. In the next session, we'll, uh, I guess, go find her daughter and check out that new area down in the surface. Thanks for watching, and if you haven't yet already, go ahead and uh, subscribe. Alright, take care.